Hello, Remy here, and welcome back to the Transient World. Welcome to the Great Western Express. And we are in London on our way to Reading, but not only on our way to Reading, we are about to start a four hour shift. But first, before we can stop, we have to uh, go to Reading. I will get into it in a bit or what or what am I talking about and what I'm going to do in a bit just uh, yeah let's quickly grab our mandatory coffee from here I have my lunch uh, box with me and uh, uh, basically I'm ready have to be ready by uh, 20 minutes past 4 basically we are making it and I'm going with this one so uh, first before I'm getting into into the stuff um, first things first and uh, I shall thank and cre uh, give credit Give credit where credits are due. Um, the first of all for uh, Chris Robson to make this possible, and uh, also Treno Marcus. Uh, who made the uh, service service mode timetables? So basically, this is a uh, service mode, and uh, I'm not gonna go wait about to, about detail too much. Uh, I will link the uh, video under uh, uh, over over the description that basically sums up what I'm what I'm what I'm doing. And uh, also uh, thanks to tra uh, Train Sim TV for uh, basically making a video about it. Um, Tom, I believe. So thanks to uh, thanks to you as well. So um, what basically am I doing is um, driving a. In a roster, um, as Chris Robson made the uh, driver roster for uh, Great Western Express, including Class 166 DMU and Class 43. And this shift is uh, early evening, short shift, but I stop saying short, I just say shift. Um, and introduction goes as that with the introduction of timetable mode for trains in world an opportunity arises where a pseudo star roster can be made to help give some structure to driving services in game this roster is designed to give you a semi-realistic look at driving to a roster which operational staff will follow in real life Over the next, well, I'm not going going to. Basically, I will link uh, the video for a uh, train uh, sim TV um, in a uh, in description, and uh, there's uh, more detailed information. I'm not going to too much into it. So just uh, uh, summing up. So basically, uh, the roster is like a uh, timetable, it's very well done and it's giving a spawn point. Well, as I'm doing this as roleplay, uh, I'm not going to do it as spawn point. For me, it's like I see book on point as a reading, reading. and as a roleplay, when I'm playing in uh, Great Western Express, uh, because action is closed, uh, I'm role playing like that. I'm going out from London, so I have to get to Reading. 
in this particular for this particular uh, shift so that's what I'm doing getting to Reading right now to Pukompai it also has a uh, uh, description of what to expect like uh, like uh, uh, today particularly for this service uh, early evening service uh, sorry early evening shift it's uh, after completing service 1k69 the cleaners need to make sure the train is clean for 2d55 you will need to wait until 5 o'clock before boarding to uni for its return working so that basically gives an uh, gives me another element of role play which is absolutely brilliant because I love role play and um, I've done it a bit but I have figured out like how to take it more like serious and dirty and this is exactly what what basically Chris Robson is uh, enabling me and anyone else who wishes to do that to So basically going to a lot more into detail and this is not going to be like how I'm going uh, This video is not going to be about how I'm going to reading this video is going to be all four hours Crammed in one hour or so or maybe even a couple videos I'm trying to keep it uh, lower, but I thought it will be lower. So I sign up from here uh, during the during the shift I do two service videos as well from point A to point B to uh, keep basically keep up to how I'm going on and stuff stuff so this is basically a virtual vlog of me working in a driver roster in trains involved virtually and we'll see how it goes it's going to be a little bit of challenging knowing me uh, I can't keep time very well not the timetable but yeah we'll see how it goes so if you join me I'm very glad and uh, let's see how our, our day unfolds on a Great Western Express To change uh, oh, from there to over here because of the better view. We are we are arriving to Reading. Well, I am arriving to Reading, and um, uh, ten minutes early, just as uh, I want to. But there's there it is. Uh, so I have enough time for. Uh, quick cigarette and uh, for another coffee for uh, before the uh, another before another service uh, well before uh, until the start of my shift which is uh, which is good especially because coffee uh, probably get tea one later on uh, well, right now I fancy coffee so I'll get coffee. Well, actually, we are a bit more uh, more than uh, ten minutes early. We are fifteen minutes early. It's okay. Hey, so uh, I go get some refreshments, uh, and uh, then I'm going to a platform eleven uh, to start the shift.
As I was watching this HSD over here, uh, our our uh, my ride actually arrived, so time for me to run a bit. Uh, yeah, I did uh, try to do some uh, train spotting. <laughs> Oh, I got kind of this one. Anyway, let's focus on job at hand. We are working today, not just uh, train spotting. Maybe train spotting should be done uh, when we are not on uh, on our shift. Actually, so this is our f this is um, our first time on our shift and. Uh, Let's see, can we, can we get, can we get, can we, can we, can we get, no, I cannot, I have to wait yet, so, it's okay, I will wait then, a um, little bit, and uh, then I will get on, so this is uh, basically, this series, Uh, I will get into it in a bit. Let's close the door. Uh, this is the service. Uh, 1K69. And uh, just between London, uh, sorry, between uh, Reading and London. So, where does it originate? Sorry. Uh, it doesn't say yet. Anyway, I know what I have to do, so let's get things going around here. Uh, if I only remembered, oh, it's unlocked. Let's put the reverser off and now uh, neutral and stuff. I'm I'm getting uh, stuff ready. Opening the doors and stuff. Uh, I don't need reading light. Oh, dimmer was there. Yeah. That's the dimmer. Anyway, so uh, here here we are, and uh, we'll see in London, basically. So we are about to arrive to London. By now. This is. Yeah, pretty good. And the London tea, uh, we have to wait for a bit to let cleaners on board and stuff. So I don't think that cleaning over here in cabin is driver's duty, but. You know. Disinfect, disinfecting stuff, and you know. but anyway, I'm doing what I'm told. Basically, <laughs> and the next service I will do a long video as well. Uh, I mean, to all service what we are taking uh, from London to Maidenhead. We're speeding, ay ay ay, bad me. No, should not speed like that.
should really not. Two miles over. I think this is not too big of a crime. To be fair. Well, one mile over by the time we did hit the speed limit. So here we are. Now I have a uh, time off until five o'clock. And can clean up the uh, train. If we are not derailing it. Which we are not. Yeah, I'm unlocking. Unlocking the doors. Uh, this one goes to neutral. Where's the safety systems? Oh, what's that? No fuses over there. It is isolated. It is isolated. All good, as far as I know. So yeah, uh, thank you very much, and uh, we will see you in it. We, we have well, it's not the end yet. I'm not ending today. <laughs> My day is still going on. So it's five o'clock. Should get back in there. Uh, should get back in there as it's five o'clock. Uh, I forgot when I left the cab. I forgot to switch the lights. Basically, I forgot them on the daylights. Hey, <laughs> wrong path. Shouldn't. Shouldn't have done it. Anyway, I noticed it anyway. So okay, over here get things ready over here for uh, basically another trip. Headlights should we run with daylights or should we? Let's do this with daylights. I think it's not that late yet. So what was it? Yeah, let's turn this one on. It's first time when I actually use those. <laughs> Train coming in. And so 
stuff. Let's open the doors, why not? Let's let everybody on board. What else did I want to do? Uh, let's put the lights on. I wanted to do something else. I forgot what. Hmm. I forgot what I wanted to do. Anyway, doesn't matter. I'm ready to depart anyway. Uh, when I remember, then I, I will get back to it. So yeah, I have a little little time to wait over here uh, before before going. Meanwhile, I can say uh, I haven't done much yet, but you can see quite a lot more uh, AI and traffic and stuff like that. Anyway, and uh, I'm excited because now we have first time can get to Maiden it where I haven't gone before <laughs> in Transient World or in real life. So, uh, just arrived to Maiden Net. Uh, the video regarding the journey to Maiden Net. There is, uh, is in the description. Uh, link, to, link to that is in the description. So basically now I have a little bit of time um, because uh, the next one is I take the uh, HSD from Reading to London but first I have to get to the Reading that means I have to go over to a platform 3 and wait for a uh, for a train that is about to depart 30 minutes past six it's basically 30 minutes away which is good uh in a way because uh i already see when we are running uh, i can look around to me in maidenhead uh train station and uh yeah why not to run around a little bit to look a little bit because I've never actually been here. Um, never ever. Oh, dispatch button. See, it's always good to run around, uh, to walk around, to discover, and to look around. There's a train going, and so it kind of it also gives kind of the feel what I have uh, doing this. Uh, uh, this short, short shift basically so uh, yeah a little bit of time I have over here so why not to take you with me around the hood voila we are here we are going there to Reading hmm, can't go further it's fine I don't know where the uh, uh, this one, this train goes. Where what we took here? It goes somewhere. Eventually, I'm pretty sure it goes. But it's not my thingy. Can we go here? No, we can't. Funny, it's modeled. The waiting area is modeled, but it can't go in there. Yeah. Hmm, <laughs> doing this can uh, play some uh, maps and stuff. And um, walk around stuff. Can't go over there, sadly. Or maybe can, but I don't know how. <laughs> Unless we do it illegally. Uh, Not gonna do it. I'm not in a mood. 
Besides, it is this run pretty fast around here. So platform 3 is where I have to be, so that's here. Basically, and I uh, wait for a train. There's really nothing around here. I mean, no shops. Uh, so. uh, yeah, waiting. Mm. I still have my lunch. Uh, my, my snack, sandwich. Uh, with me, uh, I haven't consumed it yet. I will eventually, maybe. Uh, well, when I want to, when I feel like it. Anyway, as uh, I'm waiting for a train, so have a little, little uh, wander around. Uh, maybe send some texts and. Uh, and smoke one or two. So that's basically I'm waiting here. That's basically I'm waiting here. Train came in meanwhile. Uh, meanwhile I was. Uh, smoking outside. Uh, it's funny actually. Um, I I did quit smoking, uh, but when I when I felt mentally fell off the cliff, I I turned back on it. So yeah. Uh, anyway, all right, it's coming to um, I hope that. This service what I'm supposed to wait is not going to mess up my shift. I hope it asks before do I want to abandon it. Because I'm go going towards Reading. In Reading I think uh, I have a short PMB. Uh, PNB, personal needs break, if you don't know. Oh, hello. Uh, where do we go? Let's go over there. Let's go over here. It's still going past. It's, like, it's actually quite enjoyable. Oh, the services here, you see. Well, I've seen so far. Uh, Going past and going around. Definitely see a lot more than uh, usually. <laughs> Though, same time about the same one because I usually spend quite lots of time on when I'm playing around because I use mainly use the free room anyway. So at Reading uh, we have a uh, 10 minute, uh, well I have a 10 minute uh, break, um, good for actually um, to get a uh, sandwich and to have some snack and uh, then uh, taking to uh, service to uh, Taking to HST to Bennington, uh, so my only HST run on this uh, in this shift. This is actually okay. And once in London, can call, uh, can call it, can call it a day at uh, half past seven. But first, we have to get there. Uh, I have to get there. Um.
getting ready it's reading about 30 minutes time so so it's good uh, look, looks good looks good definitely looks good Look at that. I decided to come by at right at the right time. And we'll leave that be. And let's walk over Brickstone. Had a little, had my sandwich as well, and uh, had a little stroll around. I actually wanted to show you that a little bit. What I, what where, where we can go and stuff. Which way, which way? Let's go here. And so we need to go to the platform 11. Well, let me quickly check. Uh, yeah, platform 11. So a little time until. Uh, It is 11, yeah? No, it's 10. That's 12. That means 11 here. That's the cargo train that's going. So, yeah, and um, had a nice break. Uh, Got the tea. Uh, still have it. Have, have it actually. And uh, and looking, looking towards the waiting for uh, for a train and uh, and stuff. To uh, finish the shift. <laughs> well, first I have to take the train to London, of course, and uh, shift will be finished and. London. Be a really nice one. Uh, uh, early evening shift is uh, quite relaxed, so, um, time-wise. So, so yeah, been enjoyable, enjoyable one actually. And I really, really uh, like like that idea and uh, to play the game like that. It's it it adds it adds to a role play and uh, you do see it more. You do see more. So yeah. That's the way it is. So our service, my service is coming in. The one with that oh, I'm taking on. The HST service. But this one is over there. Driver change. Yep. So let's go. Let's go and catch up to this one. I will 
would have waited on uh, other side of the platform but I just wanted to see this one coming in so uh, why not We have a little bit. We, 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 I have to wait a little bit. Oh, good. Can port driver change in uh, in motion as it is. Yes. And one more is coming in. Stopper service. Hey, <laughs> ah, it's someone, a person. Right, ah, where are we? Where's Masuki? Unlocked. Good. Stay unlocked. And start to not push that. Okay, steamer. Ah, it's. The drivers leave everything on. Well, I'm instructed to turn everything off. Right. You know, night lights will be nice. Uh, yeah. I think I'm ready to go, basically. Yeah, I am. So, uh, let's let's get things going. Where's the cabin lights? I want the cabin lights off. This side off. Uh, that side off. Yeah, a lot better that way. Don't need them on. It was on off here. Yeah. This one actually can be on. I don't mind it. I like when it's uh, when it's on. So that's how it looks. Let's speed up. Otherwise, we because we still have timetable to keep. After all. And little more to go until we get to the London. Well, I get to the London to finish up the shift. It's actually a bit sad that shift is ending, but well, four hours is actually good, 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 good amount, good, good time. 
pay over free actually but doesn't matter it's, it's actually good time it's just enough to keep the appetite to play and not to get burned out for one with one shift so that's 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 the most positive thing I need to need to keep an eye on speed as uh, London is approaching Paddington is approaching fast well I better be dude I, I better do that then. I'm sure I get there without any problems so almost there I mean while I'm uh, I'm arriving to London I wish to thank you uh, for watching and uh, special thanks for again special thanks to Chris Robson for making this possible and giving idea to this video by doing a huge huge work by by putting together the uh, driver roster in timetable mode which I can't imagine the work and effort that's gone into into it's definitely quite a lot uh, again the details and everything will be in uh, in description uh, the with a description of course uh, regarding the the uh, tribal roster uh, uh, the link will go to train sim uh, TV train sim TV uh, video uh, explaining about it and uh, also if you are interested you can uh, download it yourself as a PDF and uh, role play and follow the same type, same path basically if you are interested and also the link will uh, the link to the uh, full service what I did full journey what I did from uh, London to Maidenhead will be in the description as well um, so yeah I thought that will take you to uh, at least one journey as well then uh, the full journey so so it will be in uh, in description Everything fun will be in description. We can go a bit further. Yeah, that's good. That's good. I'm happy with that. people probably want to get off as well no wrong button and I should clean up here uh, let's put the 
headlights to uh, marker lights. Just marker lights will be will be will be good enough for now. This is isolated. Yep. And So, well, let's put lock both. Yeah, no, let's go, can we can we move further, please? So, um, I'm done with my shift. A little bit longer, a little bit, and uh, I will log off from my shift and stuff. Uh, I'm done. Really, really done. Um, I'll leave like, to uh, the next driver everything, and uh, myself, I'm, I'm going to uh, wherever st stuff goes. Over here in Paddington. And we're back in Paddington, I can say. Back in London, back in Paddington. Nice one. Going home. Thank you very much for uh, coming, uh, uh, for spending the uh, day on Great Western Express on the uh, early in week short shift. Uh, we'll be back with this. Uh, but no promises about the series or anything like that. Maybe we'll see eventually where it could, how, how it develops. I take it nat naturally. I'm not gonna force anything or anything. I enjoyed this. Uh, I enjoyed Racing World and I do enjoy the work uh, Chris Robson has put into, into this tuning. It's dark and my name is Remy and uh, see you around and uh, hope to see you on the next journey future journeys meanwhile stay safe keep, keep yourself safe um, and uh, be sensible and all the other good 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 fishes uh, good wishes <laughs>